I'm thinking that now we could maybe go to the... What is this tower called? I have no idea what it's called. It doesn't show a thing when we enter it. This is the Lost Tower. Oh, Lost Tower. There's a persistent fog that thickens the higher you climb. If you can't use the hidden move defog and you have no business here, there's no need to go up. Well, I guess we just did get defog. Um, yeah, that certainly seems like something. Um, we could teach defog to... to Lin. And Steel Wing as well. Could be very spicy spice, you know? We're gonna be stuck with Defog for a good while if we do this for like a very niche thing. If only Atlas could learn Defog, you know? And Defog isn't even a good move in battle, so we might just have to like, you know, waste a slot, essentially. Um, reducing the foe's evasion stat, yeah. We're just gonna be stuck with that for a while, I think. Unfortunately, shout out to Defog, the worst HM in all of Pokemon. Yeah. Sure seems like, huh? Um, I'm curious, can anyone here learn Shadow Claw? That would have been interesting, wouldn't it? Have? Yeah, a Steel Wing is a pretty good one. Flash at least has use in Nuzlocks, does it now? Steel Wing could be pretty spicy spice. Alright, no four moves. Yeah, let's go ahead and learn Steel Wing is what we'll do. Yeah, 70 power steel type move. Not a bad thing. Yeah, thanks. Let's learn that, have a steel type move in our arsenal like that. I haven't looked at our TMs in a good while. There's grass and all that I could always teach, technically. Um. Yeah, I don't think we need to learn any of these other ones. That's not the stairs. This is the stairs. Well? Way, Luigi! Ghost, get away! Eek, help me, team! Welp. Reducing accuracy can be the difference between victory or defeat with harder rules. That's this is true. Imagine if, you know, Defog had something to do with accuracy rather than evasion. Like, accuracy and evasion are connected, I mean, but... You know. Imagine. Imagine for a hot second. Um, bite, I guess? Because sure? Okay, well. It was Moth and used Bug Bite. So rude. Whoa, so rude. So unbelievably rude. Oh, and you're faster than me now. I moved first before. Does hidden power have priority or something? What is this? Oh, it did like nothing good. <laughs> did like nothing good. Okay, I have a blanket under my desk because my legs get cold that, you know, was taken off when I went and picked up that water. So now I have to put it over my legs again because my legs are starting to get cold <laughs> as we trek through the lost tower. <laughs> Flare gods getting some points. Cool. Chatot. Time to send in the tactical refrigerator. Yo, <laughs> when it comes to chat on and being able to make like your own cries for it by recording your microphone, ever seen any clips of people who just like completely scream into the microphone? Okay, you just have like the whole default thing, Rebob. Time for shockwave. This is what we better do. My goodness, take that chat on. That's for continuously taking all my funds at the guild. That's what happens. That's what happens to you, or something. My goodness, welp. Julio, Julio, about to send in Barboach. Welp. I know that Whiskash is water ground. I don't remember if Barboach is water ground or just water. But if you're water ground, then I can definitely use this as a great opportunity to restore my HP off of you. Only possible use for defog in battle before gen six where it removes entry hazards is in a randomizer where you have a Moltres so you can defog to Fire Blast so it doesn't miss. <laughs> oh cool, oh, we got some HP off of that. I guess that's A play, huh? But we're just gonna have like a trash slot filled there. I'll live for a while, I guess. Sad times. Sad times. Hey, you're no ghost. Took you a while to notice that, didn't it, kiddo? Found an oval stone. Welp? Why do I have a feeling there'd be hidden items? Yo! I... I just thought that this was gonna be the dowsing machine. I can literally... We can literally on command do the... Whoop! Really? 
No, well, I don't know. Um, so niche that you had to pull that situation out of your hat just to justify its existence. My oh my. I just have a feeling there'd be hidden items, you know? Call it a hunch. You're gonna have fire types, aren't you? I think. If only we knew water type moves. What? Oh, that? No, I wanted to switch. I can see on this floor just fine. Thank you very much. My goodness. Can I use the situation with Zapdos and Thunder, but Rain Dance exists and is better? What does. I put my take it from me. Team Galactic, ever since I've never forgiven their faces. Well, why are you battling me? Does it. Does Rainy what? Roughneck Kirby. Roughneck Kirby sent out Cleffa! Uh, um, player defeated Roughneck Kirby. Gwah! <laughs> well, dream my Pokemon any favors by ruining his memory like this. Can't be walling around forever. I gotta move on and turn the page. Aw, uh, that's, that's so saddening. And oh, come on. And Roughneck Kirby, who has a Kalefa. My goodness. But that's interesting that Rain makes Thunder never miss. That's actually news to me. Is the thing. Hi. I can't explain it. Being here compels me to battle. Being over the graves of the dead just compares me to battle on their resting place. Pokefan Leonard. What? Did I just say Leonard? Leonard. My goodness. Bet you he also had a Galadin and Polion before they were stolen? May well have. May well have been the case. I'm getting pinged from places that I will double check really quickly. My, my. Well. The f I can't believe the freaking the Vaporeon named Flareon. Whoa, look at all those hearts. How lovely on l literally on the graves of the dead. Well, we'll go ahead and razor leave you. I'm just looking over at the layout. What a team we have. Grottle, Staravia, Cricketune, Rotom, Fridge, Vaporeon, and Bidoof. <laughs> I don't know how it's come to this, but somehow it has. Somehow it's come to this. By whatever crazy twist of fate it has come to this. Well, let's go ahead and razor leaf. Is what we do. Okay, well, a critical hit. Poor Pichu. Still outclassed by Pikachu and Smash. Player defeated, Pokefan Leonard. Huh? What was I just doing? I don't know. Doing something more respectful than- I love how the people on the ground floor literally tell you to be, like, respectful. As you're going through the tower and, like, the graves of the dead. And then everybody on every floor just challenges you to battle. Like, my goodness, crunch, crunch. Crunch, crunch, munch, munch. It's super effective. It's super duper effective, though. Yeah, gain those experience points. Gain them real good. Up we go. Did I... Like, this fog is not, like, unplayable around at all by any means. Did I... I need to shake up my sword. Please battle with me. Did I just waste... A move slot on Lin with defog for something that I didn't even need to go through the tower cuz like I can see here clearly I think I might have made an awful mistake the fog is deep oh does it affect battles oh what makes your accuracy go down oh oh Oh! Oh! Don't know why their accuracy is just perfect, but... Oh, come on! Wow. 
Well, I mean, uh, learned Mega Drain. Doesn't use Mega Drain immediately, just learns it with that move slot for the rest of the battle or something. Because when you play Pokemon, you want Fire Emblem 6 hit rates. My goodness. Well, I guess we will use Defog here then, I suppose. I suppose we will. Player defeated Pokefan Rebecca. My sword is deepened. Huh. No. Huh. Huh. Welp. Hmm. Hmm. We're just gonna go back to the watch, I think. Just wanted to listen to that. Well, ah. Hi. Makes no difference where we are. If you have Pokemon with you, I reckon you ought to battle. Even if it's literally on graves. Uh, my Pokemon is a lively one. Let me show you how much. Man, this is really messed up. <laughs> my goodness. I know that's a reference to something. I don't know what. I'm sorry to say. Bell and Pa, Beth and Bob? Bell and Pa, Beth and Bob? What? What? Whose name is who? What? I am so confused. You what now? It's not very effective, but it'll hit both, so sure, I guess. So sure, I suppose. Oh no. Don't. It's scary. I need to switch out, probably. Most likely. It's gonna be not very effective, but it hits them both, so I'll take it, I guess. Will that be good enough for that other one? Oh, come on! Well, I mean... We'll take out that one. With a quick, quick attack, methinks. My goodness. My oh my. Please be on Lin. Okay, cool. Thank you. Welp. Now let's use Bite. Julio, Julio. Okay. But Quick Attack should do it right. Quick Attack should be enough. Yeah. Yeah, nice. You call to learn why his name Bob? Bob the Builder? Is that the reference for Conkleder? Maybe, maybe play defeated Bell and Pop, Beth and Bob. Got a lot of giddy yap in you. Well, aren't you a lively one? Welp. It was certainly something, wasn't it? Found a te Didn't I already have return? Was it frustration that I had? I thought I had something like that, at least. I could have sworn it. <laughs> but no idea, ghastly. How very ghastly. Hmm, yes. Oh, quite ghastly. Why am I so slow? I'm so slow. Like, my goodness, I'm so slow. Well, I'll take those experience points, though. Thank you. I need them for science. Is that because of the reference you're going for? But given how many of your later mons have mundane names, it became so much more fitting. Gotcha, gotcha. Can't embarrass myself again. Not in front of my girlfriend. I don't want to look bad again. Not when my boyfriend is watching. <laughs> what a beautiful couple, huh? You're challenged by young couple Mike and Nat. Murkrow and Misdreavus. Oh, what a... What a pair, huh? What a pair we have here. Welp. Sure, lower their attack with Intimidate, I guess. What? Oh, but I could also do the Bite of 87 on the Mistrevis. Sure, let's try this out. Let's see what happens. Imagine if that was a crit. Oh no. It's scary. It's a wee bit scary. Okay, crunch, crunch. Oh, come on. Well, we'll quick attack the Murkrow, I guess. I suppose we will. Oh no. I am very scared. I go to level 22. Wants to learn quick attack. When do you get your first water type move, I wonder? If I don't have a TM. Um, 
before you can get rid of Growl, I guess. Sure. We just gotta jam out to the your health is in the red thing, Bob. Okay, that's on Lynn. No! Best couple in this series is the one in Heart Gold Soul Silver. They have an Onyx and a Cloyster? Is that a thing? Is that actually a thing in Heart Gold Soul Silver? What? My goodness, Foe's Mistrievous fainted. That's a thing. What the heck? Dude, young couple Mike and Ah, Jeez, man, that's a downer. You can feel hollow inside. Oh, so hollow. My goodness. Well? I don't want to use, like, too many healing items here. Like, we'll use a super potion on Malos. I think Lin might just have to, you know, hang back for now. Is what we might do. Maybe, maybe. You can still use HMs while knocked out, though, I believe. You just fainted. Get rid of the fog anyway. <laughs> That's what you can do. Let me use defog. Still carrying my team here. Alright, so who would I... I'd be in with Voltgeist, huh? It doesn't say, like, what targets that hits in a double battle. Hi. Oh, the fog is gone, and with it, all doubt in my heart! That was quick and easy. This is my thanks. Don't be shy! Take it! It's a limited edition copy of the film, The Titanic. The You obtained the spell tag. What does that do again? That Fantina. It's hard to tell what she's thinking. Maybe world domination. But she has a compassionate heart. You know, she's a regular visitor. I mean, there's a lot of people who seem to be visiting just for battling as well. Um, that boosts the power of ghost type moves. Hmm. We'll make our journey out of this place less frightening. Take this. Obtain the cleanse tag. Lost towers are the spirits of departed Pokemon are put to rest. Those that enjoyed long lives, those whose times were short. All the departed Pokemon shall find solace here. Hmm. Not much solace of people having battles on their graves, but... Helps keep wild Pokemon away if the holder is the first one in the party. Huh. Okay, so yeah, that could definitely be handy. Maybe we'll even just give it to Malos, like, by by default there. I might use one of my escape ropes here, though. What? That's... Okay, well, never mind. Um, counting mods you've lost in combat and your white nose luck. Uh, when it comes to Pokemon with mundane names, you have Uncle Jimmy, Bob, Steve, Fred, and Cleo, Sam, John, and Franklin. Whole bunch of... Hey, it works, I guess. Yeah, let's go ahead and defog. Just in case there's, you know, random encounters and such. So it's probably not guaranteed like a repel, but probably just, you know, makes your odds much better to not run into wild Pokemon, I think, is what it would be. What time does the game count as evening again? Is it 5? Because it's about to tick over to 5. Like, it's 4.59 right now. Are we about to see some evening? Like, in which case I'd really have to play this game like much earlier in the day for, you know, long sessions where we actually get to, you know, see the day and st Why? Why would you do this to me? Why would you do such a thing to me? Hmm? Why would you do it? Why would you do it? Okay, it's fine. <laughs> Everything is A-OK. -okay. I'm used to having really bad RNG when it comes to confusion, but it's fine this time around. If you can't come up with a good name, just give it an ordinary human name. Or freaking Flareon in this case. My oh my, I like the blue flames on the wall. All these thunk thunks. Like bashing into things. Alright, well, let's head out. 